to here. So, in the last episode, I can't remember exactly where we left off, but, oh, yes, we get the angel ring and a lot of stuff built up, and there's the coordinates to the ender um, portal and the a, uh, void, not void, um, nether world uh, fortress. So I actually had went to the ender portal and went in, I'd never been there before, so I jumped in, not knowing what I was getting into, died, then spent the next like 45 minutes trying to get back to the inner portal without the angel ring or the teleportation wand, and having to get into the end, get through all the friggin ender, uh, endermen and the dragon, and without dying, and I died like some time trying to get into it. So needless to say, I have not been back. And then the same thing with we had a little uh, guard built a little cage for um, spawning withers to so get nether stars. Well, needless to say, I had took the top two off here to insert everything, and when I put the third head on, I didn't replace these blocks fast enough, and well. The wither got out, and then I spent the next, like, hour and a half trying to get, like, to contain it again, or to kill it. And it just, yeah, it, like, smoked a few of my, like, farm animals. Luckily enough, it went over that way. And then ended up, actually, over at the village, which was nice, because it was, for the most part, distracting while I was killing it. But, yeah, it was, um, and all these, like, pillars is from when I died fighting it. So I'd have to run back to the whole like cobble or whatever I was using at the time and build a pillar up to where my grave uh, was. And at one point it was like way the, it was really a far up there and it took me forever. So yeah, the wither kind of destroyed this village. It, yeah, it, it, it decimated it. I'm not even sure if there's any villagers left in it, but we could use it for items, I guess. <laughs> Yeah, it was interesting, so needless to say, once again, I am not going to get a wither, or spawn another wither until uh, Gar can get on with me and show me how to do it properly, because I've never actually done it before, so it was just a, a test, and well, it failed horribly. <laughs> so... So yeah, I built a wall around the base, and then uh, built up this area a bit. Uh, I got down to a tier one, two, tier three blood altar, but I haven't delved any more into it just because it's a little bit out of my uh, knowledge right now. So it's getting some more research into it. But it's uh, wouldn't mind getting like the, the living armor and all that, but. Uh, so Gar actually uh, added some more power stuff along with all this stuff. The, uh, the windmills, or the windmills, the water mills, the, uh, there's some solar panels up here, which also reminds me of my cows and sheep. We have a ton of rice and wheat. So I think I could probably turn off our farm for now, so we don't just fill our stuff up with that, that stuff, we'll see. We got quite a bit of leather too, and actually for, um, we have 144 um, ender pearls, which is the most I've ever had, so that's nice. <laughs> so,
render Lily is growing. Because I got a few when I went to the, the end. After spending like an hour trying to get all the crap back. So that kind of worked out in that sense. Of And it took me a little while to figure out the angel ring. You don't actually have to have it on you. It just has to be in your inventory, which is actually really nice. And I actually need more headstone. And then lock. I think a creeper got in here and blew up. It must have been Gar, but it's happened to me a few times. That's why I put these doors up. Which should be closed. But, okay, I'm thinking they can come from down here somewhere. From down here or down in through there somewhere. But yeah, it's. Uh, Annoying. Which is why we uh, actually started the void, uh, to like do all our stuff to the void and then work from there. And then also it, it kind of it reduced the lag when we're in this void. I'm sleep. Hopefully, you guys can hear me. I actually upgraded my uh, microphone to a uh, Aki condenser microphone. It's one of the ones that has like a stand and the Wind projector and all that stuff. So hopefully that works. We'll see after uh, do the editing and all that stuff. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So hoping on Friday Gar gets on. It'll actually be Saturday morning this time because he's uh, 14 hours ahead of me. He gets on next, I'm hoping. Hoping to get the, uh, the inner yeah. I probably have to do a lot of preparing, but we'll talk you through what the hell is going to happen because I've never actually done it before. And my first trip to the end ended up me being very frustrated and spending, like, like I said, an hour just trying to eat my stuff back because they didn't let them make it all again. I mean, actually, I think uh, Gar kind of quite well just getting the gas tier or the gas into the uh, cursed lasso. lasso. So I just don't, didn't want to have to go through all that crap. I think he got an extra one in the enemy system just in case. Which I literally, because I have. Um, Dark steel armor on, dark, dark plate armor, and I have the glider on. So I basically, and the end portal is like 1581 meters away, so it's, it's quite a ways away. So I just got a whole lot of dirt, built myself up like the max height, and then jumped off and glided for the most part the whole way there. It saves a lot of time. And I actually, which is good, I actually had that soul bound. So if I died, I'd still have a way of getting places faster. If I go back to my body at least. So yeah, he left me this another present this time. And he had mentioned, you know, oh, and a wither cage has been built behind the wall in front of you. So I looked behind and I saw it. And I was going, this looks pretty simple. So I, I researched how to do it. And then I just kind of, I did it, but I didn't, I wasn't quick enough covering it up. And the freaking wither got loose. And then that was another, like... Our escapade. So yeah, he built a, uh, a void dimension. So, get that, have that, jump these ender pearls in. Sky stone block. We need that. Okay. Left on the chest. Let's take a bunch of these. I 
there. Skystone block. It's actually look bad. Oh. Skystone. Skystone block. Skystone turns into Skystone block. That's a lot of freaking. I wonder if I'm going to. Here. Aha, it does, and I can do three at a time. Nice. Sky stone in there, and you'll see why. Next. Okay, so thirty seven. All right, so let's take a look at the void building or the void dimension. This is my first time with dimensions, so it's interesting. I think if I have the angel ring, because otherwise it'd be annoying. Alright, so let's go. Mm -hmm. Mod pack has chisel. So nice. I can turn stuff. I don't let, I really do I want to like actually like, turn some blocks into different stuff. Mm -hmm. Okay. Green. Hmm. Interesting. I like that. Oh, it's just that. Okay. That's easy. Wait. Block. 
rock. Gold. Gold stones. Bricks. That's a Void world. I will figure it out. I probably should figure out if I need to do the this chisel. And I actually built a builder's wand too, which is making building a lot easier. Nice. So I can't actually do that. That? No? I wonder if I can put the specs on it. Okay, well, let's go to the. I'm thinking there's creeper.